Hey everyone, today I wanted to introduce you to a free stable diffusion site called StableDream.com. Now keep in mind it is free on the day of recording this video. That may not be the case down the road. Now once you're in StableDream.com, you're going to see their homepage and it's basically just all the recent pictures that were published. I'm going to go over all that as we go. Let's just go ahead and create. I want to show you how simple this is to use. And I would say this is geared mostly for mobile users. So once you sign up with your Google account, which is the only way to sign up, I believe, click on create and a dialog box will pop up and this is your prompt area. Let's say we want to create for the holidays, a portrait of Santa Claus. So I'll type in a portrait of Santa Claus. I want to call this to your attention. It says no filter because we haven't selected one here. We have quite a few here. There's 11, I believe. There's uh, yeah, four, eight, nine, 10, 11. So we're gonna choose a, let's do a portrait painting of Santa Claus. We're gonna go ahead and click start dreaming. You'll notice the hourglass here. That tells you that it's rendering. And as you see when it's completed, it says one. If I click on this, this brings you into your personal gallery. So it basically has the same layout. And then we see our portrait of Santa Claus. We'll come back to this in a second. So if I scroll down, you see this is my personal gallery. There's no way to delete your photos as of now. And there's no other view. So if you wanted a grid view or a list view, that type of thing, that's how simple this site is. But the good news is that they are working on more features and more filters, that type of thing, right? Let's say we like this image, but we wanna create a variation. You simply just have to click on Remix. It's gonna pull up the same prompt that you just put in. And let's say now we want more of a photorealistic version. We'll click on Start Dreaming. Again, we see that hourglass, but now you'll notice this little animation graphic, this little Knight Rider vision. Doo -dun, doo -dun, doo -dun. Do, shows my age, doesn't it? <laughs> but that also tells you that it's processing. And once it's complete, bam, it's going to pop up there. So not exactly photorealistic, but definitely very different from this portrait painting filter. Right beside Remix, we have Share. Obviously, this is how you can share to social media. And if you wanted to save this image, you simply have to right click, save image as, and save it locally on your computer. Then we have our publishing option here, which is currently in red. That means your image is private. It's not gonna show to the public. If we change this to published, and we go back to the home page. You're gonna see now my Santa Claus is on the front of the home page. I'm gonna go back to my gallery here and make this private. That's pretty much all you have to know to create images. There are no options for aspect ratios that is to come. And part of my other feedback that I gave them was to have options to generate maybe at least two to four images at a time. But I did wanna mention they are creating more filters and I even gave some feedback on giving us the ability to do custom filters or save our own prompts as filters, that type of thing. And they're also looking at putting more of the standard options into this, like image to image, maybe down the road, out painting, that type of thing. So this time I wanna create a Pikachu sticker. So we're gonna do that. Click on this sticker emoji, click on start dreaming. We see our little hourglass icon here the graphic animation, and there we have our Pikachu sticker. Pretty easy, right? Now, if we look at the image, you're gonna see our little Pikachu prompt there. These are some images that I was generating on a concept that I'm working on for another video. But this one, I did my own prompts, so you don't have to use the filters. But to give it an added touch, I also included this artsy pastel filter to get this type of look. One of their main goals is to make it super simple for a child up to a grandfather or grandmother to learn just by entering a simple description and letting the filters do the work for you. These options are pretty self-explanatory. This will bring you to their Discord, which I encourage you to join. They are still looking for people to try this out and give them feedback. So take advantage while it's still free. You have your typical terms of service and privacy policies. If you click on your profile logo, you basically have the same options here that we just talked about. 
And one other thing to mention, if we go back to the home page here, you're going to see the hashtags of the filters at the top. So we click on cute isometric, you see all the images that were made with this particular filter. Cat in a bag, <laughs> that was cute. Astronaut spacewalking. Let's try not Pokemon. <laughs> and then we have this Donald Trump one. More astronaut spacewalking. There's quite a few of these astronaut spacewalking. Batman as Trump. <laughs> So it's got a really different anime type of look. If we click on low poly, this is the low poly filter. And we see the city landscape. I was trying to do some Lego Batman, which this one turned out pretty good actually. Here's a low poly example of an elf girl. A puppy birthday cake. Why would you do that? Who's going to eat a puppy birthday cake? A cat with a hat in a bag. <laughs> that one's cute too. So you get my point. Obviously you can see it's a really super simple site. As mentioned before, there are more features and options to come. And heck, everybody loves free. So you may as well enjoy it now. And maybe you could even take part in giving feedback so that they can create what you want to see on Stable Dream. Now lastly, I did want to mention in case you missed the announcement, I did open up a Discord community for the Monzon Media fam. Make sure to join up because one of the things I'm working on is a giveaway to the first pioneers of our Discord server. I'm not going to promote it much, so if there's only 10 people there when we have this contest, you're definitely going to have great odds. So make sure to head over there, join the community, post your pictures, whether it's digital art, photos, Maybe you're a musician, you want to post a video, whatever it is, come hang out with us and I look forward to touching base with you all. As always, I'd love to hear your thoughts. Link to StableDream.com in the description below. Any feedback I get from you, I'm going to communicate to them as well. So make sure to leave those in the comments as well. Now, if you're looking for another free option with a bit more features, I've covered PlaygroundAI.com in a couple of videos. If you haven't seen them, check it out here. But until the next video, good people, I'll see you when I see you.